again. I decided to do an everyday makeup tutorial. Now, this is not something I wear every single day that I go out. It's more um, the most that I would wear if I was going to uni and say I was also meeting friends or going out to lunch or dinner. Usually I would skip concealer or bronzer slash contouring um, and then just go with like mascara and then like foundation to even out my face. Sometimes I just can't be bothered, you know? So, yeah. Also, this red lip might be too much, but I just like to wear red, so you do you. But yeah, enjoy! So starting off with my facial oil, which is this Antipodes one that I've been using recently, and I really like it so far. And then in with my moisturiser and I'm mixing that with this illuminizer to give me a bit of glow because I really like that. And stopping for a coffee break already. And then using a primer from Garnier, this is the Base Perfector. It's really lightweight and it's really inexpensive. Foundation, I'm mixing this L'Oreal True Match Foundation with the Lancome Foundation, which is a little bit too dark for me. And also putting a drop of facial oil to add some more glow. And then I'm mixing that together with the end of my eyebrow spoolie brush and then just putting it all on my face I don't use a lot of foundation on a day-to-day -day basis just because I usually use it to just even out my skin tone I usually add the most foundation on my cheeks which are lighter than the rest of my face but also quite prone to redness so just I'm buffing that all in and then just go back in and add uh, more foundation where I think I need more coverage which is usually my cheeks and in between my eyebrows and then also on the neck because you don't want to forget the neck now I'm brushing through my eyebrows and filling them in a little bit Obviously don't go as heavy as if I was going out somewhere, but still enough to fill it in. And then setting it with this L'Oreal Brow Gel. Setting my face with this Maybelline powder, just the parts where I'll be adding more powder later for bronzer or highlighter. And then adding some pore pore ointment to my lips because my lips get so dry. Correcting some of my eye bags with this orange tone concealer from Bobbi Brown and then lightening with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And then blending that all out with my Real Techniques sponge which is the only thing I use for concealer under my eyes because it's just so easy and doesn't make the concealer look too heavy or cakey. And setting it with my Bobbi Brown powder because I always crease. Contouring a little bit with this Shiro Cosmetics contour powder. I think I want to do a video on this Shiro Cosmetics brand because it's a really affordable brand and their stuff is amazing and super pigmented. Just it's so great. So adding contour under my cheekbones, a little bit on my temples and my jawline. And then blending that contour in a little bit with the e.l.f. bronzer and add a little bit more colour back in my face. And stopping for food break. Okay. 
To add some definition to my eyes, I'm going in with my palette that I use for my eyebrows, mixing a dark brown and a black, and then kind of pushing that into my lash line, winging it out just the tiniest little bit. To add a little bit of definition to my eyes. There's a little bit of a difference, I don't know if you can see it. Curling my eyelashes. Seriously, curling your eyelashes makes such a big difference. So do it. And adding my current mascara, which is a L'Oreal Telescopic. I love this mascara. It's honestly so good. But you have to go a bit light-handed with it. Look at the difference. My waterline, I'm adding this rose gold crayon thing. I've tried to use a nude, but it just looks kind of weird. So I use this rose gold one. And this is the face you make when you realize that you need to get your eyebrows done. I'm in love with this Kali Bible eyeshadow palette right now. It's so pretty. Look at it. Look at it. It's so beautiful. And I love how warm toned this palette is as well. So I'm just using that lighter gold shade as my highlight. So now my cheekbones, a little bit on my brow bone. I'm in love. I'm in love with it. And of course, you know I have to go in with Mary Lou. You know it. Adding that to my cheekbones again, adding a little bit of dimension because it's a lighter shade than the Kali Bible one. Also adding it to the sides of my temple and my cupid's bow. On to lip. I'm using my most used lipstick actually, this red from Maybelline. It's one of my favourite lipsticks ever. Blotting excess off with a tissue and then fixing the edges a little bit with um, this lip brush. Just kind of setting my face with this Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray, which I transferred into a new bottle because the spray is better. The other one needs like drops on my face. This is the final look. Here's a little close up, even though there's not much to look at. Yeah, so this is my kind of everyday makeup tutorial. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you liked it, you can uh, like it or subscribe to me or do both. So, okay, bye.